Okay, so with the van, I was able to drive it back home with zero issues. I drove really slow and didn't listen to any music, so I was aware of what, what, what my engine was sounding like. I even did a lot of running around after I got home, and so far there's no really cause for concern. So what I'm going to do is just kind of put this on the back burner for a little bit. I'm not going to forget about it, but as you know, I just spent over a grand on my van and I just I just can't afford it right now, <laughs> to be honest. So yeah, we're just going to put it in the back of our brains and hope that she's okay. My mechanics are aware of this situation and we're just going to continue on from there. I was going uphill, like a pretty steep hill, so I think maybe it was just like, ah! you know, so... Let's just hope it doesn't do anything else, okay? Because I don't... Mm. Anyway, I have been in a very off mood all day, which is why I haven't posted about this sooner. But, you know, a lot of the times people are like, you know, you should talk about the bad things about van life. And here's one. <laughs> when you're having a bad day, there's no going home. Your home is your vehicle. And so when you're having a tough go and all you want to do is take a bath that's not really an option so i find a parking spot and unfortunately as much as i can shut out the world with like my um little window coverings and stuff you still hear people and sometimes you just want that to stop which is why i go to the bush a lot during the summertime and usually winter if my van's working properly you know what i mean so bad side of van life. There you go. There you have it. <laughs> now you may be wondering, well, how do you deal with it? Well, I took a little bit of a nap today. I'm finally finishing girl dinner from last night and I went to a yin yoga class, which made me feel a lot better. So now I'm going to get ready for bed and my biggest mental health tip is journaling. So I'm going to do some of that and then hope for a better day tomorrow.